Hey guys, good morning, Ranch Boss here. I showed you the other day on a video of a horse I had to fire. Now I'm gonna show you the second horse that I fired. This is baby horse right here. And we've let her run around. I gotta keep my eye on her because she'll sneak up and bite you. We used to let her run all over the ranch and she was raised with the zebra here on the ranch and she got real ornery in the process and became kind of mean. And uh, I've got my little, my little grandson now that's out walking around. And the last thing I'm gonna take uh, is a chance on uh, my baby boy getting hurt by this ornery horse. So this horse has been officially, just like the other horse, fired off the ranch. And I tried to get her loaded in a trailer, oh, I don't know, 10 days ago, and she wasn't having no part of that. So I thought my next uh, solution, I don't even wanna tell you what my next solution was, We'll skip that part. <clears throat> so, uh, the cook asked me if she could have this horse, and I says, you can have this horse, but you've got 30 days to get her off the ranch, because I'm not gonna take a chance on a honorary animal hurting my little grandson. So, she has kept this horse tied up, taken away its freedom, and believe it or not, this has become a good horse. And uh, she's gonna, we, we rode this horse about, uh, Oh, a couple, three years ago, she's sneaking up on me here. I gotta get, I gotta get past the length of her rope. She, she, this horse has bit me bad before. Bit uh, my daughter bad before. Bit my son. This horse has bit some people. You don't turn your back on her. You keep an eye on her. <clears throat> but anyway, um, it seems like with discipline in her life, she can be a good horse. But I don't have time to uh, deal with her. So out of the four or five horses that we've had here on the ranch, I'm gonna be down to about two. But uh, they're good, those other two are good horses, and as long as they act right, they're gonna have a home here. So this is the story about Baby Horse. Now these are the two remaining horses on the ranch. These are good animals. And this one has a ranch on it. Let's get that off your hair there. You all tangled up here. Try not to pull her hair, because that's gonna make her nervous. Yanking on her hair. Well, I'm gonna have to do that when I'm not uh, holding this thing with the other hand. But a few years ago, a customer of mine who lives in Houston, who had a little uh, country home, he had these two horses, and he just didn't have time to mess with them anymore. And he asked me if I would be willing to take them off his hands. And uh, he brought them out here to the ranch and turned them loose. They were a little bit bony because he kept them in a small corral. But here they get to run around hundreds of acres. And these are happy horses. I call this one Mama Horse. She is one sweet animal. This is a good horse right here. She's very, very humble, very meek horse. And we call this one Sister Horse. And unfortunately, she's starting to get some cataracts in her eyes. I don't know if we can. She's getting a white spot on this eye right here. So this is this is sad, but you know, nothing we can do about that. But these are the two remaining horses, non-aggressive, loving horses, and they are welcome here at the ranch because they act right, unlike the other horses. <laughs> 